Well, the weather in Cleveland yesterday was miserable, and the Eagles played just like it. More sloppy football as the birds dropped their second game in a row. Sports director Don Bell joins us now. DB, I love my birds, but they're not very good right now. Mm. Man, it was tough to watch yesterday, wasn't it? Yes, sir. Very much so. All right, so, yeah, so check this out. For better or worse, when the Eagles gave Carson Wentz a $128 million extension, they essentially put a ring on his finger. And now the two have to work through the worst. Wentz and the Birds lost to the Browns by five points yesterday, but the game wasn't even that close. Carson threw two picks and leads the NFL with 18 turnovers. He's also first in sacks and at the bottom in completion percentage. But head coach Doug Peterson is sticking with his guy and trying to keep it all together. Uh, as, as poorly as things have been, uh, we still have a great opportunity in front of us. And I want to make sure that everybody understands that we still have to go out and practice. We still have to meet. We still got to do the things that, you know, uh, to, to prepare ourselves for each for each game. And I just want to make sure that everybody understands that, hey, we're all in on this, right? And it's kind of like we're pushing our uh, chips into the middle of the table, uh, so to speak, and, and everybody's in. And, and um, I haven't noticed anybody not being in and uh, wouldn't expect that. Now, Peterson says benching Wentz would be a message to the team that the season is over. Next, a Monday night showdown with the 7-3 and three Seahawks. We'll have more on the birds at 6. Until then, I'm Don Bell. Back to the studio. Mm -mm. Okay. DB, we'll see you in a little bit. Thank you so much. We'll